working on now is our Frisbee, uh, Frisbee hopper indexing device that's going to allow a Frisbee to drop out of our, our three Frisbee hopper into our Frisbee shooter. And the way that's going to work is I'm going to use two pieces of this Modulox channel, just single sections on each side, and they're going to rivet right here like that to our, to our hopper frame. And then this, uh, this PG motor is going to mount right here and drive a sprocket, one of these sprockets with a 25 chain, and there will be another sprocket up here to this, uh, to this little four inch wheel on a shaft, two of these wheels on this shaft. With that, we've got a chain uh, reassembly tool from 221 Robotic Systems. It's pretty cool. It, instead of using master links, you actually disassemble the chain and can reassemble it using this tool. So take the 25 chain out and you've got to measure it here. And then the theory is that you can use the, the slots to go ahead and tighten that chain as a chain tensioner. Uh, so just try to get the best alignment that you can, but leaving just an ever so slight slack, and then you can adjust the alignment that way and tension. Our final shooter for our robot in three days. Again, we're using the Modulox channel. Uh, we've cut it down to two slots to take up a little bit less space, but we still wanted to be able to have that adjustability with the wheels to be able to slide them back and forth in and out of place to get that final tuning. Um, we're still going to gear up the motors uh, to try to get the wheels spinning as fast as possible, um, but we may play with the gear ratios as we go along. 